After much of the nation enjoyed a mild weekend, frigid weather is on the way for a large chunk of the country this week, forecasters said, warning of dangerously cold and chills over portions of the central USA. Over the next few days, temperatures will be 20 to 30 degrees below average across the nation's northern tier, the National Weather Service said. Several locations could see record-breaking cold. For example, Rapid City, South Dakota, will dip from a high of 53 degrees Sunday to 1 degree for a high on Tuesday, the Weather Service said. Across Nebraska, wind chills Tuesday will dip as low as 40 degrees below zero, which can cause frostbite to expose skin in as little as 10 minutes, the Weather Service said. Carry a winter weather survival kit of traveling in rural areas, the Weather Service in North Platte, Nebraska, warned. The cold air will also invade the southern plains. By Wednesday morning, Amarillo, Texas, will see below zero wind chill temperatures, the Weather Service predicted. This compares with Monday's forecast high of a balmy 72 degrees. CNN reported that over the next week, more than 70% of Americans in the lower 48 will experience temperatures below the freezing mark, and more than 15 million will endure temperatures below zero. Along with the cold, heavy snow will bring a reminder that winter is not over. A swath of flowable snow is expected from Wyoming and Colorado through northern Nebraska and the Dakotas to Minnesota, Wisconsin and northern Michigan, AccuWeather meteorologist Renee Duff said. On Monday, the Weather Service warned that increasing wind may lead to significant blowing and drifting of snow. Near blizzard conditions are possible over parts of North and South Dakota. Travel is discouraged. Total snowfall amounts will likely exceed 6 inches from the Dakotas into the upper Great Lakes. More than 12 inches are possible in some areas over the two days, the Weather Service said. Severe thunderstorms and potentially flooding rains are in the forecast over the next few days across portions of the southeastern USA. The hazards associated with these thunderstorms are frequent lightning, severe thunderstorm wind gusts, hail and a few tornadoes, the Weather Service said.